Balaclava is quite unique in the fact that we've had the same group of volunteers working here at the racetrack for over 50 years. In the last uh, 15 years to 20 years I've returned over $200,000 in cash to the community, to the charities in the community and a lot of that, if not all of it, comes from outside the area. It's good for the town, it's good for the race club because the quality of the food is amazing. The late C.S. Hayes used to always have afternoon tea in the dining room and it was a highlight of his racing day. So it's all homemade food, um, so that makes it special and uh, they're a great bunch to work with and it's a very, very valuable asset to the club to have that group that never let us down, are here through thick and thin. They are a treasure, they are a living treasure and they, they just bend over backwards to make sure that everything's as good as it can be. Companionship, talking, the good day out, <laughs> mainly. We all work together well um, and they're very appreciative and helpful to each other and especially new people who come to help us, like the young kids as well. We're open for more members to help, especially in the younger age group, just to have fresher legs than what we have, I think, some days. <laughs>